mother is concerned about a child's immunity right from when they are born because uh, you know you want to breastfeed because that means immunity you want your child to be strong so i breastfed for a long time for almost 11 months so immunity was a, a concern and it's a concern i suppose for every single mom and um, at every age and stage you're concerned about about immunity all through the twos uh, you know he would catch every infection that was going around and i'd say you know i breastfed for so long why 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 is he still falling sick but at the end of the day as a mom you should also know that when he's falling sick he's building his own immunity up i mean you can't keep your child also in a sterile environment where uh, you know they're not exposed to anything because uh, you i mean scraping knees getting a fever now and then is all a part of growing up am i right I, I'm not speaking as any expert here, but I'm just saying, as a mom, you're concerned about immunity. You're concerned about your child falling ill, and um, at times I used to say, "No, Veer, you shouldn't do this. You shouldn't go into the swimming pool. You shouldn't uh, go and play. The weather's turned. It might be too cold for you." But of late, I've I have, as I said a little while ago, adopted this yes mom approach, and there was this lovely social media campaign started by by Sipla about. Um, how it's important to become a yes mom because it it uh, it's about you know letting your child be letting your child free letting your child develop his personality his or her personality you know so uh, i have become a yes mom and um, i must share this with you when i was a no mom um we used to the, we used to always call me boss girl he used to sit on the seat next to me and says mama you're tough you're the boss girl <laughs> and of late now since i've become a yes mom he's started saying to me uh mama you're my best friend and i think that it really feels that every single day he says it to me at least twice a day he plays a song for me on the radio every morning uh, on on the you know on the music every morning uh which is called you've got a friend in me so <laughs> he's he started looking uh, looking to me as a friend as well now so it's very important to have taken on this yes mom approach having said that discipline wise we still have to say no right moms So my next question. I'm going to add to that. You know, um, it used to be morning, evening milk uh, for my son, and uh, in the evening there used to be this, on the way back from school. You know, I don't want my milk, and there'd be all this complaint. So I cut down to one glass of milk in the morning. That's non-negotiable, and he has it. And there's there's no yeses at that time. <laughs> I'm just saying drink. But in the evening, because he doesn't want to have that glass of milk, I give him. Uh, you get these flavored yogurts. They have a little sugar in them. but there's calcium going in and he enjoys it and sometimes he doesn't have one he left two so you just find the alternative i suppose and there's no fight there's no there's no drama it's yeah. very cool he, he happily has those those yogurts you yeah, know so that that helps so great i'm glad okay great <laughs>